hello thank you for checking out my video and today we're looking at single step literal equations level two and it's a continuation from the single step literal equations level one and remember since there are equations we're basically just performing opposite operations to isolate whatever variable is being indicated okay now level two it shows more complicated um, variables and numbers within the equation but the steps to do it are extremely similar and you're just going to do the opposite operation so let's take a look at a few examples so here on this first example it says to solve the following equation for b and be sure to take into account whether a letter is capitalized or not okay so the first thing you want to do is we want to find that B and his B right here and we want to isolate the B by itself by doing the opposite operation to whatever's going on to the B so here we have the 5 and the Q and they're both being multiplied to the B so in order to isolate the B we're going to do the opposite operation and divide by 5 and Q. Alright, so whatever you do on one side, you have to do on the other. So we're going to divide this whole expression here by 5 Q. Now, on the right side, the 5's cancel out and the Q's cancel out, leaving just B. Isolated. Now, on the left side, we've got F plus 8 divided by 5Q. And then this would be your answer. Now, what you have to do is be careful on how you type it in. Okay, so um, when you type this in, you want to put it in parentheses. You want to put F plus 8 in parentheses, then hit divide, and then 5 and Q. That way it'll look like this. But if you don't do that, you end up having, if you have F plus 8 divided by 5q what happens is the f is going to be f plus 8 divided by 5q and that's not what you want you don't want that at all you want this up here that way it looks like this so make sure you put it in parentheses Alright, let's take a look at another example. Alright, solve for the following equation. For D, make sure to take into account whether the letter is capitalized or not. Alright, so we're going to zoom in here and we see we want to isolate this D by itself. And you got this more complicated expression is FQ minus M. But the whole thing is being multiplied to D. So you do the opposite operation, which is divide. And even though it's a, a binomial, meaning it's got two terms here, it doesn't change. We're just going to divide by that whole term. So we're going to take the F. Let me change colors here. Okay. Awesome. Okay. Let's try that again. So we're going to divide by F Q minus M and do that on both sides. And it doesn't hurt to go ahead and put it in parentheses. So this term cancels out this whole term, leaving just D. 
and d is equal to n divided by f cubed minus m. That's a capital M. And remember, make sure when you type it in, put it in parentheses. All right, let's take a look at one more example. All right, solve for the following equation for B. Make sure to take into account whether a letter is capitalized or not. So we want to isolate that B this time. All right, so here we got the B, and it's being divided by this whole expression here. And the opposite of division is multiplication. So we're going to multiply by F minus H squared. Now since it's a fraction, you can put it over 1, so you can multiply that way. On the right side, we have R times this F minus H squared. Alright, so what happens is this cancels out, leaving b over 1. So you have b is equal to r times f minus h squared. And that's it in a nutshell. It's, it's more stuff, but it's still, for level 2 here, still just one step literal equation. And that's it. Um, I want to thank you for checking out my video and have a nice day.